For tonight's debrief, we're stepping outside of the studio and we are getting out into Delco, visiting the theater. Yes, this is going to be one of the many times you see us out and about exploring some of the very cool places in Delaware County. So tonight we are at the Hedgerow Theater to talk about something exciting they have going on for the next month, as well as the history, Monica. The history, a lot of history. Like, like you hear this? These, these floors have a story to tell. The space we're standing in now was a historic grist mill as part of the Rose Valley um, Arts and Culture Movement. And um, it became a theater early in the 1900s. Hedra moved in at 1923 with founding artistic director Jasper Dieter, who stumbled on this place and just felt this needed to inhabit live performance. And it continues to feel like a bit of a best kept secret in Delco is kind of amazing. But the artists that have come through this space I mean, it's it's mind-blowing, the work that's been on this stage, the artists who have come through. We've had world premieres, we've had U.S. premieres. Hedra was the first professional repertory theater in the U.S., which is amazing. And we are drawing back on those roots of legacy within our repertory by having more than one show running at a time. So we're running Shirley Valentine, which is a solo show and very heartwarming and lovely. We're running it with um, the new Electric Ballroom, which is a very um, exciting and um, unexpected production, I'll say. It's set in the west coast of Ireland, and it's set in a small rural fishing town, and it tells the story of three sisters who are replaying an event that happened 40 years previously and how it has um, made them um, stay within their home and not go outside side and how they reenact and replay the trauma of that evening. Um, saying that, it's also a play that's full of comedy and music and uh, profound moments that really speak to what it feels like to become stamped by story. We have Marsha Saunders, Janice Dadaris, Stephen Smith and Marcy Bramusi and their performances are exceptional, um, incredibly powerful and I think because of that it's going to connect with an audience. It's a really powerful play. It's about, you know, feelings of loneliness, about what people say about us, about how we speak about ourselves. Dancing, singing, long monologues, moments of intense um, arguments and joy. So it really covers the full gamut of what you want out of a performance. And what's cool is about all of this, it's right in the heart of Delco, Rose Valley. It's beautiful, it's tucked away, so really? definitely will have to visit it. And there's a number of educational programs and summer camps if your kids want to get involved. So hedgerowtheater.org has all that information to check it out.